G'day, Joel Salem here from Chucky Chucks to give a quick pitch bender demonstration. Now, if you don't know the pitch bender, when you squeeze on the plug point, it changes the pitch. I'll give you a rise. Effect. That's squeezing now on a one and a three. Which isn't exactly super funky, but it kind of works. But if you squeeze on the two and the four, one and two and three and four, one, two, three, four. And then you can switch between the squeeze on the one and the three and the two and the four, like this. Now squeeze on every beat. I like that. Let's squeeze on every off beat. That's hard. <laughs> and it's really hard not to go like this with your mouth while you're doing it. Now, you can bring an off beat there. With a little bob. Going from juggling cushion moves into the pitch bender moves is pretty easy. What you gotta do is rotate the ball in your hand until the plug point is at your thumb point. The other thing is, if you turn the pitch bender into that orientation, it gets more of a broken accent. Turn it that way, more staccato. So you can work with those accent choices. Mellow yellow, and get the big two and the four grabs on the big blue. Pitch benders, squeeze at the plug point, changes the pitch. There is one millimeter of movement between the two halves of the ball, which feels like it's not meant to be. Like when you first get them out of the box, you go, oh my God, what, they're broken? They're not. That one millimeter of movement between the halves is what gives that pitch bend option. And they're, and they're really strong, super strong, made of polycarbonate, with a stainless steel bolt through the center with a lock nut and then plugs to cover that up to make it super tidy. Pitch Fenders by Chucky Chucks. Enjoy.